Philadelphia plays host for this matchup between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Philadelphia Eagles. Back in your days when you had to take on a team from the AFC, didn't know them all that well. What was it like as we have this little interconference matchup today? Well, I thought back in those days, Jim, we were about ready to show them what toughness and hard hitting was. Uh, today it's a little different, but I'll tell you this, this NFC team, they are a hard hitting bunch. Deshaun Jackson with a chance here on the kickoff. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. First and 10. McCoy is going to secure the handoff. And they're going to run it right. And that's the type of run I think this offense would take all game long, Phil. Good day ever. They would love this. This is, this is showing your dominance here. The offensive line doing a good job, but also a solid job by the running back picking up some good yards. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy. Nice tackle. The defense stands up early and stops the run cold. Good job that time. You said it, Jim, by the defense. They attacked the offensive line, and there was nowhere for the running back to run the football. Third and five. LaShawn McCoy takes the handoff. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. When a coach can ever run, it picks up those kind of yards. It gives them confidence, and they will show more and more patience with the running game. So the defense, they better dig in here. They're able to move the chains after that last run. And he'll try it left. And they bring him down at the 44-yard line. Well, the long run that time, and there's a lot of reasons why they got that long run. But the, the biggest one, the good blocking up front, but what patience for the running back. He did not panic because it took a while for that running lane to develop. When it did, he saw it, he hit it, and he used his talents to get down the field for the big game. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Slashing to the right side. Well, I know it was a short run that time by the, by the offense, but it's what it's going to do for you long term. Keep running that football. Try to wear the defense down. Play number six coming up on this drive. Vic standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Right where it had to be. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. Sometimes they tell the receiver just to go long, run a fly route, run a nine route, because that means straight ahead or a streak. Show the speed that you have and get it done. This play set up by the long gainer. Going across the middle, the pass fails to find the mark. Second down following that incompletion. Michael Vick will take it from the gun. Launches it down the field. And it falls incomplete. They went for the deep throw, but the defensive back was there. Yeah, good job that time. I got to give the defensive back a lot of credit. He was not caught sleeping out there. He was alert, read the right keys, and he was right with the receiver to knock down that deep throw. Play clock's running down. Jackson's a receiver in the slot. Delay of game will cost him five. Delay of game, offense. Still third down. Hey, 
The yellow marker against them has set up a third and 15. Looking to scramble. The tackle is made short of the first, and that'll bring up fourth down. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. That ball is going the other way. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. First down here. Quarterback flips it to the running back. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. When you make play call. Calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. They'll try over again on second down. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That time the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read. But these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcell said to me once about Mark Bavaro, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. First and 10, quarterback. Quick toss to the outside. Going to lose yards here. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Second down following the run. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Andy Dalton will be under center. Third and long. Looking to the right side and throwing. They pick up the first down with that reception. Perfect defense call that time. They allowed the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. Play number six coming up on this drive. The give. Now makes the move to the right. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple yards. Offense lines up here. The defensive captain looks over and signals an immediate timeout. here after that run play. Here's the quick toss to the running back. He's in the clear. What a nice run by the running back. Picks up big yards and he did everything that time. He picked the proper hole, gets through it, and shows that speed to get the long game. Let's see how they back up the big play here. 15 minutes down, 45 minutes to go. And you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. That 
long gain sets them up here on this play. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. That's why you like defenders who are good punishing tacklers. Make those receivers worry about coming over the middle. They'll be careful the rest of this game because of that big hit. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Breaks the tackle for a game of two. Hard to score a touchdown sometimes when you get in the red zone in the NFL. Why? Because the defense doesn't have to worry about passes down the field. The offense runs it. They are ready to get it done, and they do, and stop the offense for a short game. Play after play after play here on this drive. He'll fire it out to the left. He's got the touchdown. I give all the credit to the wide receiver here. What a route. Fooled the defender. He is wide open. Nice throw by the quarterback for the touchdown. He made it. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. They've got him down there. The Bengals with a nickel look here on defense. Wide open for the catch. That'll stop the play right there. That well, was a nice throw by the quarterback that time to, to get just enough yards to pick up the first down. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. They're going to get him this time. This defense is awesome at blitzing. That time they blitz, they get the sack on the quarterback. They time the step count perfectly and catch the offense by surprise. Second and 22. He'll fire it out to the left. Challenges the coverage and has the completion. Well, that's a good route that time by the wide receiver. They call that a post route, and they call it a post route because he is running towards the goal post. Nice throw and catch. It'll be third down. He'll throw it over the middle. Almost intercepted. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield. Punt the football. Offense lines up here. Long ball to Deshaun Jackson. The Bengals turned the ball over on down. Well, they don't get it on fourth down. That was, man, that was a quick drive, wasn't it, Jim? That was just bad play calling, bad execution, and go to the sideline. That's where you deserve to be. extra weight out there for this jumbo set he's got some daylight well when you try to tackle this guy his legs are the size of a refrigerator so hard to wrap him up that's why he picked up the big game Back to the line of scrimmage after going for more than 40 yards on the previous play. First and 10. That's Dalton finding A.J. Green. Nice throw that time by the quarterback in the red zone. Gets a completion. And there's some tight spots. Not a lot of room, so you got to really drive the football in there. A 
offense lines up here. Handoff, touchdown, Cincinnati Bengals. How about that? The fullback scores the touchdown. He does all the blocking, gets beat up all the time, but nothing like getting the football where you can score to get it done. Count it. Bengals ready for action. the same as a touchback as he's tackled right at the 20. Split backfield here. First and 10. Fix looking long. On target. When you play man-to-man -man against this receiver, you're going to have a tough time. Quarterback's a good thrower. Really hard for a defensive back to stay with him. They've got a first down now after that catch. And Bont has perfect from behind the line of scrimmage. This defense, they are definitely not faint of heart, are they, Jim? They will bring the pressure. Good blitz that time, and they take the quarterback down. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. Well, they call it the post route because you're running towards the goal post, but a good route that time by the wide receiver making that cut. He gets open, gets behind the defense, and a nice throw. Paper, paper, paper. We're moving in on the two-minute warning. One more snap first. First and ten. The defense gets the sack. That's an excellent job by the defense. Just gets quick penetration in there, hits the quarterback, and gets the sack. That clock keeps moving. What a job by the defense in this situation. The defense got to the quarterback, and the offense is backed up here on second down. Down the field. And they can't connect. Well, they go for the bomb, but the defensive backfield was not fooled. Yeah, they were all over at that time, and they just, that was like shadow defense. Wherever the receiver was going, the defense was right next to him. Great job. The Bengals' defense now is going to go nickel. The throw to the left. Tip away. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. formation here for the defense long ball to Deshaun Jackson touchdown that'll close the gap nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can who can just fire that football into some tight spots and then it helps when the receiver He's got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough throw. driving extra point is good The Bengals are ready to return the kick. Ran the tape with a chance to run back this kickoff. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First down. Setting up screen. Catch is made. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards. Gets a first down. 
They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Barwin gets to him for the sack. Uh, not a good job by the quarterback that time. Inside of two minutes in the first half, you got to get rid of the football. If nobody's open, just throw it away. That time, he loses yards by taking the sack. Defense comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Can they get another sack right here? Is third down. Incompletion on that hurry throw. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Kevin Huber being called on now for the punt. Jackson's going to try and return this punt. He stacked up at that point. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. First and ten. Screen pass. Brings it into his body. To the 25. The Eagles call a timeout and are left now with only one. That reception gave them the first down. Vic in shotgun formation. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. That second down coming up. Eyeing that left side. Pass is made, but the hit knocks the ball out. Incomplete. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. Offense lines up here. Third down and ten. Reggie Nelson makes the tackle. The Eagles with no timeouts left. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. McCoy. Trying to touchdown. You got to give the offensive line just a lot of credit. It's first and goal. They just line up and power the football in there. Nice run, but a great job by the old line. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. Time. First down and ten. Dalton's turning to look downfield now after selling the play fake. <laughs> Failing to complete that one. So second down here. And here he goes. 
Good job that time by the running back getting down the field and picking up big yards. The Bengals in field goal formation. The Bengals are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. Mike Nugent lining up for the field goal. the first half and you've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. Danielle's got an update from the sidelines. Let's go to her now. Danny? I got a chance to quickly speak with Coach Lewis during halftime. Tie ball game here guys and Coach told me the second half is going to come down to a few plays. As a coach you never know which plays they might be but it always comes down to a couple plays here or there and he just hopes his team will be on the right side of those plays. Guys back to you. Thanks, Danielle, and now we'll go to the field. Green Ellis is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. They break through, tackle him behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Andy Dalton will be under center. Goes deep to A.J. Green. Incomplete and almost intercepted. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. They face third down after the incomplete pass. Andy Dalton in the shotgun formation forces a three and out. When you talk about a blitz on the defensive side, it's all about timing. Disguise it to the last second and time up the snap of the football. They did it that time, and they get the sack on the QB. Jackson's going to try and return this punt for a gain of about five. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. First and ten. Working that left side. Complete. And they tackle him there at the 34. Good job by the quarterback that time. He doesn't panic. He reads that it's a zone, and you have to wait for the receivers to get in between the defenders. Nice throw and catch. Cooper is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Fix going to take it from the gun. Fix looking long. Clutch catch. There's just so few quarterbacks who know how to throw it high and far anymore. Nice job that time by the quarterback. That throw was right on the money. After the long game, let's see what they do here. He's going to the left, and that's good for only a yard or two. What a good job by the defensive player there, just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Picks up six. Teams in the NFL spend about 30, 40 percent of their time all week long practicing plays in the red zone. So there's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works. How about that one? 
touchdown. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. they got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. He'll start his return. He is tackled at the 40-yard line. They face first down. Setting up a little screen. Pat Chung makes the tackle. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. A.J. Green with the catch. Good job by the offense getting in the red zone. Now you're down some points. you got to find a way to score a touchdown. Second down now. Charles is taking the handoff. Four yards. Nice job that time by the offense getting the first down inside the red zone. And it's a good thing they got a quarterback with a strong arm because you got to throw into some tight spots in the red zone. First down here after the run. On first down, it's back to the ground game. I think you got to be a little more creative in the red zone than this. When you just line up and run the football like that, you're not going to get a lot of yards. And that time, they just got a short game. Second down coming up. Dalton's got it in the gun. What a hit, and the ball is dropped. Does it take talent to do something like this? You've got to time the pass, where the football's going, where the receiver's going to catch it, and do the perfect timing. Hit that receiver, and that football comes flying out. Nice job that time. Incomplete pass. The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Terrible job that time by the defense. Third and goal, they're expecting pass, and they still can't stop it. This defense is just not fast enough to stop those touchdown passes. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. Deshaun Jackson with a chance here on the kickoff. Spins away from the tackle. And he's out across the 20 and tackled at the 21. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. Throws to the right. Sticks to his hands. That's a tackle right near the 48. Corner routes not thrown enough in this league anymore. A lot of teams don't do it because it takes a strong arm quarterback to get it done. That was a terrific throw up the field that time. Now first and 10. Throwing now to his left. Has the reception all alone. When you play zone coverage, the quarterback might have to hold the football just a little longer. But these guys nowadays, when you play zone, they know how to throw and catch and get it done. First down, following the long play. Looks to his left. Makes the grab. Touchdown. 
Nice job running that fade down the field. Nice throw by the quarterback, and we get a touchdown. The Eagles now will tack on the extra point. Oh, it's a fake. Got the touchdown, got the two-point conversion. People love to go for two in this game, don't they? Well, they do, and you know what? Now I guess you and I just can't sit here and blast the coach for a bad decision. When you pick up the two points, you can't complain about what they're trying to do. He's got a chance to return this one. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Final quarter underway now with this snap. They spotted at the 42. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stopped him for a short game. Quarterback coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Breaks the tackle. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. What a job by the offensive line that time. This running back hit the hole at full speed, and the defense had very little time to react. And that's how he got in the secondary, made a couple guys miss, and gets down there and gets a long run. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Good job by the defense. They are all over the throw by the quarterback. They all pick it off in the end zone. Well, that's a big opportunity missed when you drop a pass like that. Andy Dalton will be under center. Second down and 10. And he's forced to the ground. The offensive coordinators just got to make some adjustments here. They can't stop the defensive line from sacking the quarterback. So either keep the tight end in or keep the halfback in to help block for the QB. Third and 16 here after the sack. Great coverage there on that pass attempt. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Receivers are bunched up. Dalton will take it from the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. He's brought to a halt. Well, they're a gambling football team. They like to take chances. Even though they're down, it's in the second half. They take another chance. They go for it on fourth, and this time they got it. Play number six coming up on this drive. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. And the throw is incomplete. They bring in the extra tight end. Second and ten. Andy Dalton gets it out to A.J. Green. Nothing too exciting here. Just plowing ahead 
getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them. So far, they haven't. This defense, they better pick it up if they think they're going to stop this offense. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Tosses it, and he's in for the touchdown. Well, it's a nice touchdown drive by the offense. They're still behind, but I got to say this to the defense. You're just giving up. You're letting them march down there and letting them get back in the game. Toughen up and get it done. They'll get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. They beat him the put in addition. Two points on the board as they convert. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. <laughs> Tackles made. First down, offense readying for the snap. To the right, in on the stop. And this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time they stopped that run just for a short game. The game is tied and time is a factor. Running to the left side, has the first down. Now looking for more. Breaks free. That's a touchdown. Anytime you see a long run for a touchdown, what you got to look for is blocking downfield. Nice job by the uh, wide receivers and everybody hustling, making a block and a long touchdown run. And the point after is good. The Bengals are ready to return the kick. Kick out of bounds is going to cost them. Time that this one's running out, and the defense knows it needs another stop. First and ten, challenging the defenders to the right side, and he's brought down right at the 43. Good job by the receiver, running into that defense, through the zone, finding the open space, and making a nice catch. Two-minute warning. Defense lining up here late in this one, trying to hold on to the lead. First and ten. Off the mark. The receiver's open coming across the field, but sometimes these short throws are tough, and the quarterback throws it too far in front. Line receivers stacked up on this play, trying to get it outside before the defense is set. They pounce on him there. Boy, after watching that long run, I'm winded. That was a nice job by the running back. Good job up front, sustaining the blocks. The offense has got to be happy with that. The Bengals signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. Here's the first snap after the big play. 
completion this time. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. First down here after the completion. The give to the running back. Powers his way across. Touchdown. I would bet first and goal that the offense about 90% of the time is going to run the football. And what do they do here? They run it and they get it done. That is power football at its best. Lining up now for the two. Back to the ground. You talk about momentum. That turns into an eight-point trip, the touchdown and the two. This offense and the head coach and the offensive coordinator, they're all aggressive. So, hey, well, it's not good enough just to get a touchdown. They want to get that extra point or two points. Nice job that time. I know you were shaking your head over this one, but they went for the two instead of the tie, and they come through and take the lead. Well, I'll just say this, that the head coach is not afraid to lose. That was a gamble. He goes for the two, and he got rewarded. Nice job by the offense. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. And he is tackled down at the 38-yard line. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw a catch and just keep picking up those first downs. They've got a first down now after that catch. Looking across the middle, Ray Maualuga in on that last tackle. The Eagles decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. Eagle, Eagle. Double, double, double. Offense lines up here. It's second down and three. Running to his right, and he's out of bounds. When you're going against a really athletic defense, there's nothing like reverses and the counter run game because they see it, they go, and you counter it, and that's why it works to perfection. Patient, patient, patient. The Eagles get set to snap the football. Wait, Only wait, wait, one wait, wait. timeout remaining here in the fourth. Michael Vick will take it from the gun. Looking to the right side and throwing. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. The Bengals have to take their final timeout. That's it. McCoy's shifted from running back to a receiver in the slot. Second and five. Ball's on the ground. Oh, they cough up the football, and the defense takes possession. The defense comes up with the big play, the hit, and the recovery of the football. Uh, they sure did. They got so much speed on the defensive side, and that speed, when you think about it, it gets more people around the football. It helps you deliver the hit even harder, and that's why they got the turnover. Great job. An extra tight end on the field for this one.
Got a little jumpy there, Phil, and that's a five-yarder for encroachment. Yeah, I'd say he was a little bit jumpy. Quarterback, good job by him taking advantage of it. Still first down. Flag gives them a new set of downs. This one could have gone either way. Each side made some spectacular plays, but we've come to an end, and what a game it was. Uh, this is one here where you had to just hold your breath because just after one touchdown was scored, there would be another one shortly right behind it. A high-scoring affair and a memorable day indeed. It really was. How exciting, really. The, the gym, it just, it was just, you said it, one big play after another. But it happened because both of these teams, man, do they have some superstars. For Bill Sims and all the crew, Jim Nance saying so long.